Suddenly, my stunning Great Dane puppy, which was a cute bundle of fuzz, has turned into a gangly, long-legged, big-headed, crooked-eared, clumsy-pawed Tyrannosaurus, and he looks downright ridiculous. Is your puppy looking the same? Don't worry. The puppy uglies are only temporary. I promise you that your Great Dane will not be ugly forever. Your puppy, just like other Great Danes, will quickly go from an ugly, out-of-proportion teenager to an incredibly good-looking adult. In the puppy phase, you have to look after your friend without any added reward, as Layla rightly put it in her book, A Story of Promising Puppy. Puppies are a reflection of unconditional love, entrusted to us like precious seeds. We water them with praise, patience, and love, and watch them grow into full bloom. This is Maker, at seven months old. Look how long and gangly his legs are. Owner Haley commented, he looked like a foal. He was all legs. And now, look at Maker in his best in show win photo. Such a handsome boy he matured into. When will the puppy uglies start? We typically see this stage start around just about the same time they start to lose their puppy teeth. You'll get the uglies at around four to seven months and maybe again at 11 to 18 months and some in between. Do people actually show their pups during the ugly puppy stage? It is common for show breeders to withhold their ugly puppy from the show ring until they're in full bloom. When will it go away? This really all depends on their breeding, bloodlines. And while waiting it out can seem like an eternity, most are done around 13, 15 months old. The worst case scenario would be when your pup has fully matured, around two years old. What parts of my puppy will be ugly? One. Splayed feet. Let your pup walk on concrete, pebbles, and hard surfaces. This will help keep their feet tight. Added bonus, it will keep their nails short. Put those feet and water bowls up on an elevated feeder so he can keep his stance while eating and drinking. Two, legs that are too long. As long as your puppy isn't showing any signs of pain or discomfort, there is no need for concern. Before you know it, your little bundle's gangly legs will have caught up with the rest of his body. Three, ears that flop. Ears growing so big they represent Dumbo. This is very common, especially during their teething months. Typically, once the ear cartilage has matured, the days of ears going rogue will be a distant memory. Four, overshot bite, also called an overbite. Again, this usually resolves itself after teething has stopped. The bottom jaw continues to grow long after the top jaw is done growing. Five, saggy loose skin, love, snuggle, and smoosh your hands all in it while you can. One day, you will wish your Great Dane puppy never grew into their skin. Six, too skinny. Did you know your Great Dane should be on the lean side? Do not try to fatten up your Great Dane puppy. This will lead to catastrophic growth issues. Your Great Dane puppy will be healthier and happier by being reasonably slim, eating a proper diet, and exercising. One thing is for sure. All dogs are wonderful critters that are worthy of love and respect and every four-footer displays his own form of canine cuteness, even when going through an ugly stage. But some dogs are typically considered to be a little easier or harder on the eyes than others. For more Great Dane information and goodies to make your little friend feel at home, please check out the Love Margot website. Equally, for your daily dose of Great Dane joy, check out our Instagram and TikTok.